Stone Building at the Broad Street Market has reopened. But things look pretty different at the historic Harrisburg landmark. Sonica Bargo is there now live and she joins us. Sonica. Alicia, Valerie, so that stone building was not damaged in this week's fire. The stalls in there will be open as usual, but several vendors whose stalls were damaged in the brick building still showed up today, setting up tents in the courtyard. Everyone I spoke to says right now it's about supporting the market as much as possible. For Harrisburg natives, memories of the Broad Street Market run deep. I remember being three years old, coming to the market with my mom, hoping to get some delicious things from bakeries. Yes, I used to come up here with my mother, who always came up here for special season meats to go with her collard greens and kale. And the fire that ripped through the brick building Monday is why people like Sherry Crankfield I had to come get my fish. <laughs> and Vivi Sterste. And I wish I just had more money to buy more things. Are back to support the market's first day open since the blaze. I'm keeping all the vendors in prayer. We have to make sure that the workers are doing okay because without the workers, there would be no market. That support is everywhere in fundraisers for the workers. Everybody needs income to survive right now, especially. And the vendors. It's, it's, it's our home. Melissa Barrick owns Veg Out. Her stall was in the brick building. It was like a bad dream. She was able to salvage most of it, though traces of the fire remain. My tablecloths still smell like smoke even though I washed them. But she's making the best of it under a tent in the market's courtyard. We're glad to be here. I'm hoping we can be open all, all summer long. The grief remains. We're crying and there's people who are like this morning, everyone's crying. It's like it was your own home, seeing your own home going up in flames. It, it hurt. But this day is the first step in rebuilding. It's really nice to see that the market is still thriving and it's own way despite this tragedy. You know how they talk about the Phoenix rising up from the fire. I believe they're going to come back stronger. I really do. This Saturday, Broad Street Market is hosting its first Christmas in July event. Now that event was already scheduled, but now it will also serve as a fundraiser for the market and its vendors. Live in Harrisburg, Sonica Barco, ABC 27 News. Thank you.